kiss for you. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Welcome to the part one of this video series on Android app development. And so, guys, as you guys can see, that I already have created uh, a blank project that is uh, that contains a band activity, but it is empty. So we we will start uh, the building and creating our application from the, uh, from scratch. So, guys, let's get started. All right, guys. So here, first of all, we will design the XML part. Of our activity, and so here uh, we will change from relative layout to linear layout since we will be having uh, a couple of buttons. And here we will have to say that let me write uh, orientation will be the vertical, and we will have the gravity as the center. All right, then we will have a couple of the buttons. So first of all, we will have button. and we will have right like id id1 then we can say text to be simple map with marker all right and similarly we will have i will i will just copy this button code and i will paste it like this All right, so it uh, uh, right now it's giving me error. So let me just change the IDs. <coughs> All right, so now uh, we will just change the text as well. So inside this button two, we will fetch the current location, and then here in this part uh, with this button three, we will fetch. Live location. Then we will be creating the polyline. So we will say map with polylines, and then finally we will create a root. Create root directions. All right. So now we, I will go to my this is the main activity. So first of all we will bind the views. So here we guys we guys can say that private variable button one So we will create a, a function that will just uh, bind the views or initialize the views. So here we guys can see private fun in it views, and inside that we will just uh, bind the view. So we guys can see button one equal to find view by id. And for the remaining buttons, I will just. Copy paste the codes. All right, and then we will just write the codes for here for the uh, button set on click level listener. So here we guys can see button one dot set on click listener. And similar. Okay, so it's now giving me error. Let me just write this, and just write button two dot set on click listener. All right, so now we have the five buttons here, 
and so first of all uh, now we will create all the activities so for that let me create a new uh, let me write activity and we will select the empty views or blank empty views activity so here we will write first of all the simple lock activity and I will click on finish all right now we will just remove the extra code from here All right. So, uh, so similarly, we will create the remaining activities in this in this video. So, let me create the second activity, and it will be current location activity. then we will create the remaining activities here Alright guys, so now we have created all the activities here and now we will start working on our first activity and that is the simple location activity. So if you for that we will uh, integrate the library, the libraries. So first of all we need the OSM droid library. So here we will write implementation. Com dot github. sorry org dot osm droid all right and also we will be using the volley library but uh, right now we don't need this the the volley library so we will just click on sync now and make sure that you have to go to your settings.gradle.kts file and make sure that you have this Marvin uh, JIT back repository. Alright guys, so now the library has been successfully integrated but before that let me open the, uh, the Android manifest file and inside that make sure that you have this uh, yeah, the metadata, the metadata for example here you guys can see metadata uh, name and it will be org dot dot configure and there we will say the value to be true all right so make sure that you have this line as well so after that we are now uh, ready to start working on our simple location activity but we will do that in our next part of this the video series all right so, but before that, let me verify if the library has been successfully integrated or not. So, if we click on right map view, okay, sorry. Yes, you guys can see we are now able to access this map view. 
so it means that we have successfully integrated our library so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you and goodbye